and welcome. It's been a week, uh, and there's a reason for that, which I will be explaining in the video. Uh, Apologise for that. Hope, perhaps you could see it. This eye has been completely ruined. Um, hurt my eye the day after I posted the house tour, and um, it tore up this side here and a bit under as well. Swollen. I couldn't use it. The pain was actually so enormous that I couldn't even open this eye. So I was been uh, completely blindfolded for four days and then I could start to open my eyes. But everything was blurred. Things are a bit blurred still, but I do need a shave. And might as well just share with you my shaving friends, which I very much enjoy. Start of the show is going to be the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, the um, intergalactic shave ball. It's made of plastic. Very durable plastic. This is how it looks on the inside. Um, this is what it comes inside. There is a soap sample, which is called Planet Phoenix. You only get this soap when you buy the scuttle, and it is a scuttle. So you could pour in water here. And there is the stopper there. Also comes which you can store it in because it is meant for as a travel scuttle. This little cloth, which is also made by microfiber, so you can actually use it to dry up the scuttle. Today I'm not going to be using it as a scuttle. We'll be making three videos reviewing this. One, and this this one, we're just going to look at it as a lava bowl. And then one using hot water, and then the third one, that's going to be a secret. Um, I will try to use it outdoors, but not today. I don't know if I've just been very unlucky recently with the tooth and all. And thank you everyone for your get well wishes and something in my cap. Um, but yeah, it is actually still bothering me. I was going to get it checked out this week, but then the eye injury hit me and well, I couldn't go anywhere. So what are we using? We are using... Because... I, I usually do scrubbing motions when I do my lather, but this bowl does don't really allow that very much. So you have to really be aware of your technique. So I wouldn't use a cream, which would be very easy to lather, and I wouldn't use a hard pox soap to press in, which for some can be difficult to lather. So I went in the middle. Sterling, um, which is a crope. This is black guys, licorice scented. Had this for quite a few years now. Great scent. Just got out of the shower, and this is seven days of growth, and I actually just trimmed this area so it wouldn't look so bushy. Pre-shave the cube, and I went and wanted to find a standard eyes, in my opinion, would be a standard eyes sized brush, 24 millimeter, a synthetic with a just a regular synthetic knot in it. So nothing special, it is a beautiful brush, I love this. Blade of choice is going to be the mule, this is the third use. And what better razor to take down seven days of growth. You might not be able to see it because my hairs are actually quite uh, bright and almost see-throughish. But on the neck, you can also see how it swirls around here and there and grows. Sonic lasers. It's very difficult to shave in my beard. The McCurfer Tour, everyone. So uh, I think I've introduced everything. Yeah, I think so. Let's get started. So we're back, pressed it in the middle. I'm gonna be using the brush, flick it. So it's wet, but not dripping. I'm gonna be gathering the soap and then use big squirling motions, both sides to create the lala. Let's get started.
blade is in the razor and soap has been lathered up quite nicely uh, perhaps a bit more thin than I usually would but uh, perhaps that's going to be worked in a bit better on the face uh, also bear in mind that the well this lather looks just fine no mess in there and it is a small ball this small scuttle um, because it is meant for travel but look it does peak so it's good um, the pre-shave does act as a lot of boosters so bear that slightly in mind let's go it does have menthol in it this shaving soap I will be finishing the lather on the face as I usually do mm -mm -mm -mm. it's gonna be incredible to get rid of this beard growth here yes yeah, so the added with the the pre-shave does kind of look pasty so we'll dip the brush in water and add more water to this perhaps it's just a scuttle like this um, you might have to be a little more patient than I am creating your ulala I'm used to just like boom it's there less than a minute but you know I know I don't know it worked great it's good for travel and you can use it as a scuttle to get a nice warm shave or something else which will be in the works yeah the move is is not started yet um but will slowly begin putting things in boxes and whatnot a nice liquid scent all over the bathroom so yeah and there is a few re uh, reviews of some stuff that I've been planned the next couple of times um, wet the razor cold water shave as usual setting six actually a bit beyond this is the six let's go get rid of this growth Forgotten how aggressive this can be. Nice. So yeah. Um, never had an issue with the mule blades, uh, but it can be, in my opinion, uh, very different. How many shaves that I can get out of them? Usually, it's free. Look, no missing. Uh, but I've actually had a blade once. It just wouldn't give in. I think I had almost up to 12 or 13 shaves out of it. It was off before I started this channel. It was it was a monster blade that. Just a regular mule blade. But it took 13 shaves before it started to show signs of anything. No overhang on this razor to be aware of, so you can just mow on on. So yeah, my eye looks kind of lazy because of the injury. But it will get better. Yeah, the children are playing at the bank as usual. Yeah, and the first couple of days with this injury here on the eye, couldn't sleep. It was so powerful, the pain. I couldn't sleep. Perhaps I slept, passed out more likely, for about an hour. And then I would wake up again. So yeah, I spent the night sleeping on the couch, so I wouldn't, <laughs> I wouldn't wake up everyone because of my moaning. I said, "Oh, it was so painful." Um, 
And then, have any of you tried that? It's dreadful. So anyway, the tooth is going to be looked at in a couple of days and we'll see if it's something that can be fixed or what. Second application. Oh, this is... Oh. It's amazing to get a shave after an entire week of almost complete misery and I'm getting so far off, so much behind on packing stuff up, work stuff because I've been away with toothache and now my eye injury there's a mountain of work on my to-do list and I need to do and I have to be working quite fast in order to get it all done in time also packing stuff up and yeah go down to setting five for cross the green I hope you are well <laughs> and I hope you are doing nice and good And uh, thank you, all of you who watched the house tour. And again, I apologize for the mess. There's one more. I actually have to apologize to you. That's my daughter. I'm sorry, Catherine. Um, I didn't get to do a birthday tribute shave to you because her birthday was the exact next day after that I have. Um, I will be doing a tribute shave to you later. I won't be forgetting you. So yeah. So yeah, a lot of people think that this razor is slippery. I think it's a good grip. Oh, yeah. And by the way, just as long as you don't get soap on it. And by the way, there's actually a new razor in the den. A new razor and a new razor head. Up for review. And we're, of course, also going to be reviewing the soap sample that came with the scuttle. But I wouldn't want to use, on purpose, one of Phoenix's own products with this because I know how well the lather and uh, it might, you know, you might want to try, oh, I nicked myself, I actually got, I, I noticed that because I got a wrong angle, that was me, that was me, not the razor or the blade, um, because you might, not all might not have Phoenix PAA stuff in their den and would mind want to use some more regular stuff, but I think Sterling is great. Premium quality stuff. But a bit more affordable. Than the PAA stuff. So that might be a bit more, you know, up there in the shape dens. So Nice. Third application, let's go for it. And snow missing with all this beard growth and the Makova tour. And the menthol level, it's nice, it's good. You can certainly feel it. And the licorice scent is also Phenomenal. In the summer months, this soap is fantastic. I did cut myself really much. Not much, but a lot there. I did cut myself there. Not just the nick, because I can feel it. So against the growth, setting four I'm on now. My 
be needing to get the alum for that one. And this was the third use of this blade, and I did feel slight pluckiness, but my hair was also very, very uh, much out there. Felt it here. But, yeah. I'll do a face wash and I'll see you at the post shave. So welcome back. We'll just be putting on a bit of alum here. This is how my looks. Good for travel. Um, there's an air at the hole at the bottom so it can breathe. It's wet. Put on water, cold water on this one. And we'll just dip it right here and it will sting. Yeah, it does sting quite a bit actually. Ouch. We will let the alum do its business. I don't like using alum actually. Uh, for me, I discovered that it was actually cause for skin irritation because my skin was pulled. You know, it, it pulls the skin to the, tightens the skin. So I just dry this and leave it out to dry. There you go. Dry, nice and refreshing, cooling. We'll leave this area uh, for now. Face wash with the soap. Just put on some slight cream. Before we put that on, we'll just wash here. Wash away the alum. Dry. Good. And then we'll go through what we used. BBS completely. This is how we look, by the way. I feel. I can recognize myself again. Okay, before we put on the matching splash, we'll go through what we used. The Curvatur sitting six, five and four with the mule blade third use. It's gonna be the last use. So, Pre-shave, PAA cube, up and drying. Soap, sterling black ice. Black soap, lovely stop white, great licorice scent with a great menthol feel to it. Three passes and a face wash with the content, and there's still soap left. The ball performed absolutely marvelously. You can just dry it, just wet this, leave it to dry, it's good to go again. Or you could use, if you wanted to get away quickly, just use the microfiber cloth. 
great ball, recommendable. This is gonna have a sting to it. Liquid scented as well, strong. Good stuff with, 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 with hazel and alcohol in it as well. I love the smell, taste and scent of licorice. Ooh. First comes an intense, slight burn, then a more intense burn. And then, bam, there's the menthol, yeah. I feel fantastic. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for all your subscriptions and your continuous support of my channel. I very much appreciate it. I hope I won't get into any other <laughs> mischiefs. Uh, and I hope that I will see you on Wednesday for a new shave. Have a nice weekend and stay healthy and take care of yourself and your loved ones. Bye-bye.